Okay. So team, let us understand what is multi-level bomb in SAP. Okay. Now what happened whenever you create a bill of material, it will having additional element. Okay. So it is not a single level bomb. First, there is a header component below that there are child component. And for this child component or semi finished component, there are sub components below that. Okay. So here you can see the pump is manufactured with the sub assembly of casing shaft, drive wheel and shaft. Now this casing shaft, it is having their own two element that is slug and seal. Okay. So this is called as a multi-level bomb. If you just selected this part, pump, casing, driver shaft and shaft. So this is the first level. Okay. This is a single level. And below that, if you have a sub bomb for this casing, you can refer this square. Okay. In this square, you can have another sub bomb that is called as a sub assembly. So this is your main assembly for that. That is sub assembly. So if you are having this kind of scenario, then you are having three level bomb. Okay. So let me go first level wise. Okay. So this is level zero, your pump, then spiral casing head. This is your level two and slug steel and all that is your level number two. Okay. So this is zero level. This is level one and this is level two. So this is called as a multi-level bomb. Okay. This is called as a multi-level bomb. Are you clear with the concept multi-level bomb? Let us create in system now, everybody. So in case of our yeah. laptop, okay. If you go to our laptop. So our laptop is having bomb. Okay, let me delete this. Huh? Now, assume this is a battery. There is a screen and there is a laptop. Okay. Now this battery is having some component as called, assume that the component is a charger or we can say uh, socket, battery socket. Okay. And charger. These are the two components. There are sub component of this battery. Okay. So let me create two components for you. I have not selected DFT or something like that. It's going to be my raw material. Cost of it is going to be 100 rupees. Okay. Enter. Yes. Okay, so we have created battery socket. Okay, material display. Battery socket one material created. Now let us create slash show mm zero one. Battery okay. Battery charger, okay.
now now what we are talking we are talking about multi level bombs so here is our laptop and these are the three first three component what is that battery screen and box battery screen and box clear now for this battery there is the sub assembly sub bomb so let us create a bomb for this battery now what we have to do simple we have to take battery as a header material and create a bomb with t code cs01 cs01 is t code to create a bomb so i will go for it and here i will provide battery b15 is my header material i will press enter button with usage and here i am going to provide the component first component is battery charger okay atom category l now here you imagine uh, there is no assembly indicator up till now once we create a bomb it will be automatically assembly indicator will generate it okay bani your question what is the assembly indicator once you are having bomb okay then it will be get created okay next item category l and having next component as battery socket okay battery socket one quantity each enter now the bomb for battery lp b15 for this component battery l15 we have created a sub assembly or sub bomb clear everybody is clear bunny sagar akshay suraj aditya yes sir okay clear yes, yes. now once i yes. save it yes, okay. once i save uh, when i save this bomb see once i save this bomb and here there is no refresh button so i will just go back for laptop okay for this laptop and if you just press enter button you can see assembly indicator is updated clear why because we have created a bomb for this battery now what is this battery bomb component how we can see just double click on this assembly indicator and just am trying it are you okay and then you have to continue once you click on continue button then we can see there is a battery charger and there is a battery socket so this is called as a multi level bomb okay so this is your multi level bomb where there is a header component and having some sub assembly and for that sub assembly you can have again another assembly clear team um, any, yes. um, 